I've always loved cooking. It's just been a part of my life. It's been a part of my culture. I found that I really liked homes. Um, so instead of the traditional college, I took a real estate course. I guess I thought about it from the standpoint of it. It presented opportunities that were different. It was a challenge. It was something that was fairly new. I didn't want to work at a restaurant until I was 30. I didn't want to be a bartender until I was 30. Um, and I wanted to make great money. You don't have to go to college and, and start at a, a desk job and stare at a computer for 50 hours a week. Look at your options. I mean, there, there's certainly lots of professions out there that don't require you to, to get into something that you're not comfortable with doing. Changing directions is very easy nowadays. You know, people have, uh, there's resources out there, career centers. You want to really do well with something, you have to make a little bit of a sacrifice. But at the same time, you got to go with your heart and what you're passionate about. And if food is that, then culinary arts is the way to go. Being a chef is the way to go. More for me, plumbing, um, it's putting a smile on somebody's face. You know, as far as the trade industry, plumbers are like the dentist. You know, everybody complains about having to have the plumber come. And if you can, if you can somehow change that into a good experience for somebody during the day. Being a paramedic is just one of those choices. That, that you can you know you can go through the the training and, and, and the education at this point and really do something that you enjoy doing. I think that your whole life should kind of fit together and when you follow your heart and you follow your passion you're happy every day. Um, you're happy to your employees, you're happy to the people you work for and the people you work with and I think following your heart makes your whole life healthy and happy and balanced. And if you do something just for money or you do it because someone has said it was the right thing to do, you'll always fail. So if you go with your heart, then you'll have the drive, the push, the determination to finish and finish strong. My name is Corey Connor Wilford and I'm a plumber. I'm Chief Chad Abrams and I'm a paramedic. I'm Amy and I'm a home improvement contractor. I'm Shakafrika Simmons and I'm a chef.